As more people get out and enjoy this wonderful weather, police are warning everyone to be careful about how they get around, specifically using ride share services. Criminals are posing as Lyft and Uber drivers and robbing passengers. CBS 2's Roseanne Teus is live in River North, where one of the most recent incidents happened. Rosie? That's right, Jim. It happened here on the 300 block of West Erie, and police say, like, all of the recent incidents. It happened on the weekend in the very early morning hours. What we can tell you is police say the victims were fooled by a car pulling up to the curb or as as they waited for a ride share, I should say. And once they got inside, they were robbed by force or gunpoint. There have been at least six incidents on the near north side since May. Only one person was robbed on the street. She was the only female victim. Uh, we talked to some ride share users, some of whom had not heard about the robberies. I mean, it makes sense a lot of the times, especially when you've been drinking, you kind of just hop in the first car that waves at you and you just take off without thinking about it. Gosh, it honestly wasn't something that I'd really quite thought about. So Uber wants to remind users or rideshare users that all the tools they need are right at their hand. They can check the make, model, license plate of the car right on their app, and they can also get a picture of their driver. We talked to Lyft, and they say they have a new feature called AMP that actually has a beacon. Your rideshare car will have a lit up beacon on the dash, and that's how you know that that car is legit. Live in River North tonight, Roseanne Teus, CBS 2 News. Jim, Mai. Roseanne, thank you.